What is Python? Hi, Liam. Did you know that you can create artificial intelligence on a computer? Hi, Emma. Hmm, you knew that very well. I'm going to make an artificial intelligence with my laptop. I'm sure it's cool. Cool? Of course it's cool. So, I've figured out that I can make it with a Python, but I don't know much more than that. Yeah. First of all, I don't really know what a Python is, and I have no idea what to do with it. What should I do? So, you came to me? Are you sure you want to do this? Yes, I'm sure I want to do it. What is Python? Python is a programming language that was created more than 20 years ago. It was created by Guido van Rossum in the Netherlands. Surprisingly, Python has a long history, but its popularity is growing rapidly these days. This is because it is often used for research in artificial intelligence and big data analysis. It's also used by big companies like Google, YouTube, and Pixar, and web services like Instagram, Pinterest, and Dropbox are also built in Python. So, Python is a familiar programming language. Oh, I know. It was used here, too. There are three features of Python. Feature 1. Simple program. The feature of Python is to write the program using indentation. Indentation refers to the spaces at the beginning of a code line. Where in other programming languages, the indentation in code is for readability only. The indentation in Python is very important. Python uses indentation to indicate a block of code. The indentation makes the program easy to read for anyone to write. Features 2. Wide variety of libraries. Python comes with a powerful standard library, so you can do a lot of things with just Python. That's why Python is also known as batteries included. In addition, there are a lot of external libraries, such as libraries for high-speed numerical computation, image processing, and machine learning, which are often used for artificial intelligence. Feature 3. Easy trial and error. Python is an interpreted language that you can write a program and run it immediately. The language is easy to try and error, so it's also suitable for beginners. On the other hand, C and Java are called compiled languages. Compiled languages are converted directly into machine code that the processor can execute. As a result, they tend to be faster and more efficient to execute than interpreted languages. Hey, Liam, why is it called Python? It was a comedy show, but it was satirical and intelligent. Oh, that's why it's called Python. The father of Python, Guido van Rossum, said the name of the language was taken from the British comedy series Monty Python's Flying Circus. And Guido van Rossum was a big fan of the film. He was such an amazing guy who made a programming language. But he loved comedy so much. I felt so close to him.